Hey, what's up, guys? It's the Tech Price here, and today I've got some tech news for you. It's some major tech news. Apple has just announced Mac OS 10.8 Mountain Lion Preview. They've just got their preview out here, and it's the update of 10.7 Lion, and it's a little update. It's not major improvements, but these tweaks are just delightful. They're the ones that you really wanted from the start. So the first one is iCloud improvement. It's got proper integration with iCloud. So um, the main focus on this improvement is to really get everyone to be using Apple devices so you can really be using um, Apple everything. Like All your things are all on your Apple devices. Because now they've got iMessage on Mac. You can message any Mac device with iMessage. Well, the latest ones, of course. So with the new iMessage is they've abolished iChat and they've got iMessage with Gmail onto it. As you can see there's Gmail there. You can message on Gmail as well and um AOL talk as well. So you can um talk on to your friends on Gtalk as well as message your contacts on iMessage and Apple have really got the real deal with um integrating uh iOS and um, Mac OS X together and just making you use um, Apple products all the time now because with iCloud you have your work anywhere to access it you can message um, anyone with the new um, s chat settings on your Mac now they've got some n nice little tweaks here with a reminders little app it's like the one on the iPhone but in bigger with a little calendar at the bottom there and then you can just like remind yourself and the reminders go on um, the cloud as well. So um, also you've got a little notes page that um, you can um, make little notes on and um, you can put those notes on um, uh, your iOS device as well. It's basically another juiced up iOS feature on there. iOS feature is notification seat, uh, center coming to Mac OS X 10.8 and this one's a really nice one that um, would be worthy basically all your messages come up, all your iMessages will be coming up there, your emails um, whatever messages that come up there, third party apps will probably be there little pop-ups, bubbles coming up that they should have done earlier but they've got it now they've got the real deal, the edge over Windows 8, stuff that Windows 8 would probably would have had but now Apple have just done all of this and um, really got awareness of what they're doing now. It's just like um, the o uh, iOS when the little pop-up bu bubbles come, but um, now they've got it on Mac OS X. This is a feature that I um, really would like. Now another one that I um, enjoy that I'm gonna be um, pleased for is the Twitter integ integration and iMessage integration and you can email stuff. So on Safari and you can just like quickly um, tweet things that you see as you can see you can just quickly pop a tweet there and um, basically they've got Twitter integration on um, Mac now and Apple overall and you can message it quickly. Also they've got, um, this is a center game center basically it hasn't been really that popular but at last now they've got Mac so now more people will probably be using it with the Mac App Store. And a feature that I've really been waiting for is AirPlay mirroring. This is going to be an awesome, awesome feature. These guys would love it, but you have to have an Apple TV, of course. Wirelessly mirror your Mac screen on a big screen. What is a bit best feature about this is basically, if you've got like GTA, Call of Duty 4 on your Mac, you can just basically play it um, on the big screen wirelessly. Just you um, probably get a wireless keyboard or something, and then you can just play as if you're actually playing on the PS3 and Xbox, which is really awesome. And um, Gatekeeper, they've got new security here. Um, basically, you know, Apple's got the reputation of the best security. Windows isn't as secure, malware free. This is a um, chance for them to extend a company's um, 
secureness of the um, app app store and just to secure your Mac because um, as you can see basically the Macs um, they come with like iCloud and stuff and it'll probably be easier to hack people's accounts and stuff and with this Chinese feature you got like Chinese emails and stuff like this Chinese companies now and basically it's improvement for Chinese speakers who can um, for like phrases and autocorrect and rain recognition that's pretty cool and basically that's it really outlook is here um it's a mountain it's a basically to look at about your mac and stuff in a better way um basically it's more of a desktop features improvements like ios into mac but even better features and basically it just i think it's the best that apple have have got over windows 8 I think Windows 8 was like gonna um, really gonna give um, Apple a scare, but now with my Mountain Lion, Apple are just well ahead with all these really cool features that I've really been um, uh, waiting for. So just to run over the features again, got Chinese handwriting and stuff like that, Gatekeeper, better security, AirPlay, wirelessly mirroring, Game Center, you know the little like games that they like, can um with your friends and stuff twitter integration which is really cool and um, same sheet just share share sheets share with twitter iMessage and all of that stuff and um pop-up bud bubbles um notification center and um notes um reminders and messages iMessage and g uh, um iChat integrated into one and iCloud integration so thank you um, for watching guys, leave a comment what you think of this, has this really got the edge over Windows 8, are you looking forward to this, prices will be coming soon, follow me on Twitter, the tech price here, and of course um, if you haven't heard of it, Android Jelly Bean has been announced, and um, that's a new Android coming out, Android 5.0, so just leave me a comment if you know about that. And thank you for watching, guys. I'll catch you.